Hey everyone, Shaber 1000 here. Tonight, we're going to be checking these lights out. Kind of like a review, but I just pretty much want to show you these lights. Because I think they're pretty cool, if they work. But I don't know, because I haven't opened them yet. So let's go ahead and open these up, and let's check them out. <laughs> So like I said, we're going to try this out, this light mix. Sound responsive string lights and they're battery powered. And I got these for my camping trips coming up. I got one coming up this weekend on Friday. Today's Wednesday. And I got one coming up next month. So I thought I would use these. Um, 100 micro LED light strand, 32 feet, 9.7 inches, which is about 10 meters. Light up your holiday season with light mix, sound responsive string lights. Great for indoors and outdoors, that's good. Uh, let's see here, battery operated, no plugs or connectors, just turn on. Light mix LED lights, start listening. And respond to your music requires three AA batteries not included uh, built-in microphone detects a wide range of dynamic sounds from 65 DB to 110 DB light mode options you got four light mode options you got light show which is the one that responds to sound or music uh, you got steady on you got slow pulse and blinking and I like this auto on off timer automatically turns off after six hours and on again after 18 hours so that's pretty cool so let's go ahead and open these up oh by the way they are ten dollars at Dollar General had to have these <laughs> I was like wow so And here they are. So, what did I say? 32 feet, right? Where did I see? Yeah, 32 feet. So I got plenty of lights here. I thought I may put them up on my shelter this weekend. So, alright, so I've got some batteries here in my pocket. They are rechargeable. Uh, it's got a a little waterproof seal here. I don't know how waterproof that would be. But, you know, I mean, I'm sure you, you wouldn't want to put it in a tornado or hurricane, but I, I doubt if I would want to leave these in the rain. But for 10 bucks, right? Oh, and they kicked on. Uh, check. Check one, two. Check, check, check. Okay, so let's um, let me go get my phone. We'll turn this light off and we'll check them out. It must be steady on. That's the look at these. These are all blue on this side, and these are color on this side. Check, check, check. All right. So anyway, that's uh. Yeah, see, they don't have an on and off switch. So, okay, like I said, let me get my phone and we'll check these lights out further. 
Okay guys, so I got these on the music setting. Just kind of activates it. I got some music there from uh, the YouTube uh, audio library. So let's turn the music on. So that's pretty cool. Now if you can't tell, which you probably can't, but I've got this run up over the hood of the Corvette over the roof and down here and wrapped around here on the trunk lid. So, so far for 10 bucks, that's worth it. I may get another set before Christmas. Put in the Chevy. Well, you can't see the Chevy, but. There we go. That's pretty cool for ten dollars, I think. I don't know how long they're gonna last, guys. They're ten bucks. If they last one Christmas season, I'm good with that. Let's see what the lights look like. Oops. Little tiny. That's pretty cool. Yeah, for 10 bucks. I'm good with that. Let's steady on. There's the fade. There's the fast. That's pretty cool. Wow, that's pretty cool. <laughs> All right, I'll come back with my final. Okay guys, so these lights here, 10 bucks. Three, three double A batteries, which I've got rechargeables in there because um, I always have rechargeable uh, batteries when I can. Um, they're on the car right now. That's why I'm looking over there. I still got them turned on. Um, I would say, yeah, they're worth 10 bucks, even if they last one season. I mean, how many times, you know, like the ones we get, the, the, uh, re, the, the green stuff it kind of looks like a wreath that goes around our door there's two of them and the first time we bought them i think we gave 40 bucks a piece well we we bought one she was thinking it would go clear around i said it won't she bought it i said we need to buy two well they're pretty expensive i'm just buying one well we bought one and it didn't go clear around so we had to go buy another one that was 80 bucks and the first night one of them quit working next day we had to take them back and get another set now every year i got a fiddle fart around with them to get them both to work right um but so for 10 bucks if they last one season come on man how can you go wrong right i mean 
Wow. Uh, the only thing, I wish it had a shutoff on it, a shutoff switch. Okay, guys. It does get a 5 out of 5 star for me. From me. There's the button that changes the modes. Here, let me turn this light off. Just hold this button down. About three seconds. And, and they shut off. You hold it down again. About three seconds. And they come on. You know. Um, but it doesn't. It just... They'll turn off after six hours. Um, yeah, there's no way to shut them off. It's just an auto on off, which is okay, I guess. But I mean, I'd still like to, like right now, I'd like to shut them off. I don't want them sitting wherever I'm gonna, you know. I don't want to put them back in a box and have them blinking for six hours. You know what I mean? But there they are. Try to get a thumbnail for you without the glare. So yeah, um, so stay tuned for my upcoming trip like I said today's Wednesday Friday it's not supposed to rain finally it did jump up to 60% now it's uh it's still like 20% or something it shouldn't rain but it's supposed to storm like Sunday morning that's when we're coming back I'm going out Friday and she will be out Saturday so I'm going out Friday kind of do a do a solo just to try out my trailer shelter and then she's going to come out Saturday spend the night and then we'll be back Sunday uh, it's real convenient because it's like five minutes car ride from there to here so she can come back like Saturday evening check on her mom make sure she's okay and then we'll be back Sunday so but yeah I don't I don't see a thing wrong with these there's a hundred of them a hundred multicolor LED like I said it's 32 feet so it's 10 meters it's 32 feet 32 feet 9.7 inches okay so almost almost 33 feet so roughly 10 meters um yeah i think it's really cool so yeah i i would recommend them i mean for 10 bucks just save your receipt in case you got to take it back because we're on a dollar general we won't take won't even exchange something if you don't have a receipt but that's just the way they are Alright guys, so thanks for watching. I appreciate it. Um, I'm sure you'll see these lights this weekend around my little tent trailer thing shelter. <laughs> I don't even know what I'm going to call it yet. <laughs> it's a wagon of some sort. I built it. It was what I had in my head. and uh, You know, we'll talk more about it uh, this weekend. But I put the wheels kind of far back. Usually those wagons, wheels are more in the center for weight. But that thing's so beefed up it'll haul anything so i put the wheels farther back so it's easier to back because if you guys ever backed a trailer like that once they turn that's it they're turning <laughs> so anyway guys <clears throat> more on that this weekend but yeah light mix yeah i give it two thumbs up so far uh i will give it um I, i'll give it a four out of five star I would give it a five star so far if it had an on and off switch. To me, I think it just needs one. I think you should just be able to shut something off whenever you want to, not whenever they decide they want you to shut it off. I think you do it on purpose because you will use more batteries and then you go back to the dollar store and buy more batteries, I guess. I don't know. They can't trick me like that because I got rechargeables. <laughs> Shea Bear, the Myth of Man of Legend, gone for now. We'll see you guys in the next one. Uh, happy Thanksgiving and... Bye-bye and take care, guys.